where more than two-thirds of children live in low-income families. It's also now home to the Olympic Stadium and the recently opened Westfield, Stratford City, which is Europe's largest shopping centre. Westfield wanted to hire 5,000 local people, almost half of them from the ranks of the long-term unemployed. Candidates, managers say, were enthusiastic, but it was soon discovered that more than 300 of them couldn't read or write enough to fill out a basic form. Westfield is giving remedial classes to its new recruits in the hopes their enthusiasm will carry them through. But a Comrades survey shows companies all over the city feel the education system right up to university is letting them down. If 58% of London business leaders felt that too often graduates in London lacked basic literacy and numeracy skills, uh, this is, we're talking about people who've spent three or four years in higher education. So that, that means that um, well, it's, it's a really, fairly damning indictment of the, of the education system at large, and it, it leaves one wondering what, uh, what, uh, what those who haven't been to university are like. Meanwhile, the number of unemployed 18 to 24-year-olds keeps on rising. The latest figures show nearly 800,000 are now out of work. But if businesses can't count on them to be able to add up and read instructions, they're unlikely to want to risk hiring them. Laura Emmett, RT, London.